you're a glider of sorts. I mean, you're not as good as a cinema crops, but I mean, you would work. Alrighty, guys, welcome back to Ark, where today I'm out taming up jug bugs. So I already got my first one here. I just wanted to get this one done real quick because it is one with a really good recharge rate. Now, what I need for the water ones is just one with oxygen. Now, I don't think I'm going to be able to find a jug bug with a high oxygen stat, you know. I might actually be able to find one today. But it's more of the element jug bugs I want to go do. Because they are going to be harder. Because i got to worry about nameless and reapers. These guys are also pretty hard as well. There's ravengers and raptors. But anyways, I decided I wanted to get these done. So I ran over to Scorched Earth today. Grabbed some Plain Species Y seeds. Figured that's all I'm going to need. Because that's what they love. See, it's going to probably be about two each. I did plant one, and I also did get a plant species X seed, so that way I can go plant that. Hopefully those both produce seeds. I can't remember if they did. I checked both my crop plots on the island and on Scorched, and I couldn't find seeds in them. So I'm thinking that there's no way that these guys like actually make uh, seeds, you know, for me. And also, guys, originally this morning, I did not plan on doing jug bugs. I did have a different creature in mind because of the loss of golden, but then I changed my mind on it because I'm not sure on how to tame it. The instructions were pretty clear on what I need to do. I'm just not sure how I go about it safely. You know? I mean, we're going to be breaking some OSHA, re like OSHA violations. Right? We got some OSHA regulations that have been broken at that point, right? So we just gotta do it in a safe way, and I've been trying to think of one. Okay, now I gotta go hunt down a good 150 that has a high oxygen. Or a decent oxygen. I really don't know how well I'm gonna get on the oxygen. I'd like to get 40 on it. That's something you usually don't say about creatures is, I want 40 oxygen. That's the one stack you never want to have 40 in. Especially on a creature. It's just a waste of points at that, but... Seeing so the oxygen, such as like on the Prilophosaurus and on these jug bugs, involves like their main use. Yeah, on those ones you do want it high. Now I swear that there was one around here somewhere. So I did a little looking, and I found one. Problem is now is he's the same gender as the one that we already have. Now I've been thinking about this, and it honestly will make my day so 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 much easier and that would be if i had my mutator and some element well i've already gone and got those by the way so i'm just letting you guys know i've already got the mutator and i've already got some transferable transferable element over onto aberration so that way i'm able to do this and that is honestly just because i keep on running into good stat creatures but they're both the, like they're the same gender right this is gonna help me fix it and after you guys legit i cracked the eggs all the votes said yeah crack the eggs after you guys have decided all right let's go back in and change it to keep the eggs all right after you guys have done that i deserve a win and this is my win all right i got element now deal with it this is gonna be for the generator and the i don't even think i'm gonna use the generator i don't even think i brought it on if i think no, I didn't. I just brought my mutator, didn't I? Yes, I did. So never mind on the generator. So I'm just going to be using the mutator in it with element. Because I did still want to try and keep this 100% nearly no element. Element's only going to be used for the, again, mutator. And I only brought like 500 with, so I got to be very careful. It's only going to be used for gender swaps. Now, this video is mostly going to be me just running around taming jug bugs here. And then we're going to probably go into the red zone. Run around and tame jug bugs there as well. So, um, I'm sorry if this isn't that exciting of a video. It's also kind of just a rant video where I'm going to be talking a lot. Just letting you guys know. I don't know why on Scorched Earth I decided to grab me a boomerang as well. I mean, I used one of them. It broke almost immediately. Then I put on the second one. And it just, yeah, it went like for twice as long for some reason. It confused me. Like it honestly, did I ever check what your stats came out to be after taming? 
Oh my god, look at that stamina. That's a 49. That's your recharge rate as well, right? I didn't miss, miss like judge that at all. Yeah, that's your recharge rate. Resource regen, then we have resource capacity. So those are the ones I'm trying to get high stats in. Now, technically we do have you. Now what do you got? <gasps> that's a 48. That's actually really decent. And I think your guys' health is base. Yeah, your health is not going to move. So that's a stat on you guys. I already got technically locked in. Um. Yeah, that's actually really nice. Like, what's your max capacity? 800 water, 760. So, what? what's the big, like, 28? Huh. I wonder if this one just hasn't updated yet. Because that, like, would, that would be him after getting, that's him before. I wonder if I toss him out if it will fix it. Because I think that 800 there is wrong. That 800 there, I think, was his original. Yep, the 800 there was wrong. So let's make sure I don't forget my seeds. I keep on hitting escape too many times. And we'll get these guys packaged up. We'll take them back to the base. And I'll show you the work I've done at the base. Because I did have a couple days here off this weekend. And I know you guys are going to probably be mad about this. But I did, some I did try to do some recording. But mostly what you got was me walking around, uh, mumbling into the mic, like barely talking. So it's not good footage, but it, there is footage of it. Uh, I built more of the base. Uh, mostly I just put up walls and then I killed a lot of tech creatures. And I mean a lot. Okay, I was nearly lost there for a second. I think I've got myself figured out now, right? Right, this is the right way? Yeah, this is the right way. That's the... That's the hole I'm looking for. Now, there's the base there. Oh, let's not overshoot it and land in the water where the crabs are. Don't want to have to deal with those guys. We'll land over here. Okay. Jump over. Voila. Here's the base. So, not too impressive. I just put up the wall, as I said. And I did plant some plants. As you can see here, it's just a simple one. I sat around gathering poop for a while, and I didn't even really fertilize it. I just threw it in. So, we do got these guys, the plant species... This plant, plant species Z. Then we got the X, Y, and again, Z. Now, I don't think these guys make seeds. No, they do not. Um, nope. You would have probably made one by now. There's probably, like... I don't know. There's probably something I'm doing wrong. Because, like, these aren't even really moving like, I feel like these might move are supposed to move but I'm using the S plus crop plots so I might be like doing something wrong I hope I'm not but anyways now we gotta get up into the base now we got a way of doing this that actually works somehow now all we got to do is what the heck I've never got it like that. Alright, if I hop off this way, I will probably fall. It looks... Yep, I failed. Okay, let me see if I can show you guys it just walking up and doing it. Because I've done this a couple times. Is there a nameless in my base? There is. I'm not even going to deal with it. I'll get back to you guys here, though. He, he ran. He just ran into the light. I wonder where he spawned in from. Where did I cause you to spawn in at, buddy? I fell again. He's probably, like, actually, like, right in here. Like, it was probably just right here behind my, uh, gas nodes. Also, I'm going to quit just messing around here because I'm wasting time in the video. Basically, what I was trying to show you that is if you hop off your saddle like so on a rock drake, you stick to their back, all right? You know, oh, it's a in the middle of an earthquake. It's probably not the best time to do it, by the way. That hurt. Let's get you down here. There, I also do no nameless respawning, so let's get over to our light nodes. Hey, get off my... Ah! Get off me! Yeah. 
I got a light. And there we go. That's what I was trying to do. Now, we're going to throw these guys out. And see how I did stick around there for about a minute. Or a lot more than a minute. And I kind of still am dick now. We're just going to grab our radiation gear. And we're going to go down to the radiation zone. And we're going to tame up the element jug bug. Alright, so I'm fully kitted up now in my hazard suit. And I am already messing around. But the main reason I did decide to go after jug bugs today is I did run into an element jug bug. It looked pretty good earlier. So that's the one we're going to be going after right now. Now, he did have a high oxygen stat. That is the one that we really kind of want on the element jug bug, I'm pretty sure as well, because that's the resource capacity. Then what I would hope for is I can find... I hope I can find us uh, one of the high uh, is it recharge rate. Also, I'm trying to like get here so I can do this. I need you on now. This is just to dispel any uh, nameless, of course. Now, the one we're going for, he's right down here on the ramp still. Yes, he's like right in the radiation, as you guys can see here. Um, ooh, 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 ooh. If we can take him down right now, he is in uh, the range of one of those lights. Not anymore, though. Shoot. You know what, though? You're heading back that way. I will wait until you're back in the light. It's probably as good as it's going to get. Now we're just going to go until you pass out Let's see how, what you're at you gotta be like real close right you're still going you can take a couple more and what are we looking at here you're still good one two three Oh, I think I shot you once while you're unconscious. Yes, that might be bad. Please, please be fine. Please, I hope. I really hope. Um. Anything? You gonna give me a seed again when I walk by you? This light knows they're not gonna give me a seed. I got secrets on me. Oh, hold up. These are the creatures I wanted to tame. Hold up, and I'm actually kind of taming this one. I did not plan on this. Basically, the way these guys work is the way I'm supposed to tame it is like this. Where I shoot it with the light, right? Then I get grenades as well. As long as I just constantly hit you with light, it's kind of like the Phoenix. You tame. Like so. Okay. I guess we got a seeker. Throw you over there. Come here, secret. Yes. You're a glider of sorts. I mean, you're not as good as a uh, cinema crops, but I mean, you would work. Like, what are you siphoning as well? I don't need you though. I don't know how I'm gonna get you back. Oh, I guess I, I guess I could take you back. But these were the guys I was tr gonna try and tame. Um, I guess there we saw just exactly how to tame them. I just hit them with this torch a lot as they hit me and chase me. So, but of course, um, like they even say it like the these lights here, and the glow pet lights, they don't count towards taming him. It's the grenades from the plant species. Uh, What was that? I also need to get rid of you. I swear I heard something. That might have been you eating. But it doesn't look like I hurt you too much. I didn't overshoot. Okay, we're good. I'm sorry. I know. You guys are probably like, yeah, that's a nice creature. I, I just blasted it. I keep on killing my own creatures, too. I have to, or I'd have a massive overpopulation to feed. Now... How does this element... You give me... You give me element dust? 
Okay. Um. You got your like 10,000 times better already than what you were originally. I'm not going to lie to you. Because I thought you gave me element ore. No, these guys give me element dust. They gave me dust. All right. And all right, so just so you guys know, with the element dust, I can craft it in my inventory and make unstable element, right? That's the way you would make it on Genesis. Or I think there's also an option of element ore that you can find on Genesis. But with those, you can make you own an unstable element. And over time, it just decays and turns into normal element. I think I can also just make it into shards as well and bypass the unstable element. But I think if I do unstable, I get more. Right? Let me check here. I can, I can check right now in my inventory. Unstable element. Over time, it stabilizes and becomes element. I think that only gives me one, but I can craft... Like, I can craft you. But then I think I need a replicator to make element. Alrighty, guys. But anyways, that's gonna be it for this episode. We got our jug bugs. Um, I'm probably gonna go out, try and find me another element one down in there somewhere. I'm also gonna have to go find the oil jug bugs, which are the ones I also really, really need right now for gasoline. 